At breaking news out of Lakeland, take a look at these images from Action Air One crews. They're dealing with a toxic leak after this train derailed. Good morning, Tampa Bay. I'm James Tully. And I'm Lauren St. Germain and for Dia Riley this morning. And despite this big mess, no one was hurt. Certainly good news there. Let's get you straight out to ABC Action News reporter Isabel Rosales live at the intersection of Strickland and Kathleen Road where this happened. Isabel, you've been following the story all morning long. What's the latest? What are they telling you? James, that train company is telling me that they are investigating the cause of the derailment. Now, I do want you to take a look in that direction right by those red flashing lights. That is where it happened. And that yellow stuff you saw spilled onto the tracks, that is molten sulfur, and it is a problem. That's because it can cause burns and can even make it hard to breathe. I do want you to take another look at these images. CSX tells me they have sent in contractors to assess the situation, assess the damage, and figure out a way to clean up this mess. Now, I do want to be clear here. There is no current evacuation order. And in fact, just a couple of minutes ago, deputies called it safe to go outside, but are asking people to please stay away from this crash site. We did speak with one neighbor who says the smell in the air had her following their earlier orders just in case. Rotten eggs. Yeah. I, I guess smell a little bit down, down there. It's almost like a going past a car that has something wrong with its catalytic converter. That's what it smells like. Now this is not likely to clear up anytime soon. And as you can imagine, this is going to cause some major delays for drivers. Let's go now to traffic anchor Lindsay Logue. She's got some ideas on how to get around this. Lindsay. Certainly, if you are driving by that area, definitely want to keep your windows up, the AC off this morning until all of this is cleared. Isabel, thank you. So let's go to the maps and tell you right now what's going on. Kathleen Road right now, complete roadblock. Uh, this is going to be in the area of Galloway, uh, and that is where that road there is shut down. So keep that in mind, Spivey and Galloway. Uh, traffic is being diverted onto Galloway or the other best bet for a detour, depending on where you're leaving from and where you are headed to, US 98, where you can see a little bit of a slowdown here northbound, but you're in the green southbound there through that area.